hi all in today's video we'll talk about creating pareto chart in sigma so basically i'll show you the visualization in my workbook and explain it to you and then we'll create the chart so let's begin so first i'll open this workbook so basically Pareto chart explains a 80-20% analysis in which we'll find out that which 20% of our fields are helping us to bring the 80% of the business. So basically this is a combination of a bar chart and line chart. So in this particular Pareto analysis, I have the state wise commission here in the, uh, in the descending order and then this line chart showing me the cumulative percentage of the commission. So suppose the California brings the 40 seven percent of the total commission and california and texas cumulatively brings the 52.99 percent of the commission similarly this is how it is working and this red line here is showing the 80 percent line so basically where the line is intercepting this commission percentage then we can find out that from in the left side all these states are helping us to bring the 80% of the business. Suppose this 80% is cutting on Georgia. So we can say that the California, Texas, New York, till this Georgia is bringing the 80% of the commission. So this is how this analysis works. And now we'll see how we create this chart in Sigma. Now we have this data table with the help of this table we will create a sub table in which we just need two columns state and commission. So let's create a child element from this table and now we'll group the data state wise and for the calculation we just need the sum of commission. So uh, you just need these two columns to create your Pareto chart and I'll just remove these null values to reduce the inconvenience and also we have one entry this rest of us so basically all these states are the us states but this rest of uh, us has the all other states which are not mentioned here so i am excluding this too to get a clear understanding of the pareto chart so basically i am excluding this also so we have state wise commission and also we need the cumulative sum of commission but for that first we need to just sort this data in descending order and now we'll just add a new column to this data naming cumulative sum cumulative sum of sum of commission also you just rename this to be like commission and this column to be cumulative sum of commission and now just here you can add one summary so basically summary is a total so basically for a new summary you can write like sum of commission so this will be your total commission so you can just rename it to be like total commission because for the cumulative percentage we need to divide the cumulative sum by the total commission so now uh, now we'll click on this child element and we'll create uh, the pareto chart so click on this create child element and then go to this visualization so now as i said earlier that pareto chart is a combination of a bar chart and line chart so basically you need a combo chart here and for the x-axis we need we need the state and the for the y-axis first we need the commission because uh, these are showing the state wise commission and we'll sort this by uh, commission only and now you can see that for the secondary y-axis we need the cumulative percentage so basically we just add a new column here and for the formula we will write that sum of cumulative sum of commission should be divided by total commission okay so for now you can see this yellow line here so this is this line is now uh, in the y axis only but we'll change its axis and also we'll give it to be like percentage and we'll change its axis from here from this axis we'll change the axis to be on right and also we'll give this to name like commission percentage now we need a 80% line also so basically we'll 
click on this add calculation and for the new column just write here 0 0.8 and convert it to be on percentage so this will be and also change its axis to be on right so you can see this is our 80 percent line and just give it a name to be like 80 percent and also like if you want to see the data labels you can just for the commission percentage you can show the data labels also so basically uh, it is intercepting this line on uh, uh, new jersey so basically from california to new jersey is bringing the 80 percent of commission also just change the title like pareto analysis so this is how the Pareto analysis works. So basically we can find out that which states are bringing the 80% of commission. So that's all for this video. Thank you so much.